Hello and congratulations on getting access to this video course. We're going to talk about how to grow your Instagram fan base. Let's just go ahead and jump right in and this is video number one and let's talk about a quick overview of what's inside this video course so that you know exactly what to expect. Of course, this is video number one, video number two, we're going to talk about a list of things that you need to do before you can actually drive traffic. So before we actually jump right in into the four different traffic sources that we've pinpointed to figure out what is best as far as driving traffic with Instagram, I want to talk about a few things and just prepare you so that you're able to start out on the right foot. Video number three is going to be broad niche and specific posts. Video number four is going to talk about demographics. It's a, it's a big mistake that a lot of people just jump straight into trying to drive traffic without really trying to think, okay, who am I trying to attract? If you don't know who you're trying to attract, then it's going to be hard and going to be difficult on what you're trying to do. And then you're just trying to hit everything you're just trying to drive tons of traffic and at the end of the day yes you might have a massive list of a hundred thousand people but it doesn't matter if you're not building a quality list so that's what we're going to talk about in mindset in just a minute so after that we'll talk about traffic source number one number two number three and number four all right so now what I want to do is talk about mindset. I really want you to think about quality over quantity. That's why I brought up the issue with you don't want a list of 100,000 followers unless those followers are super targeted and they are your demographics. That's when it's okay, but at the end of the day, I don't really want you to think, oh, I need a list of, you know, I have to have a list of 10,000 or 50,000 or a hundred thousand so it's easy to get trapped into a I want a large following but really what you don't don't want to do is you don't want pride to ruin your profits if you look at a lot of people who have big lists they're like I've got this big list so it's it's really showy it's really prideful and I don't want you to get in that mindset because it's not about pride it's not about the big list is about providing valuable content to your followers to the point that they love you, they love your content, and they're willing to buy from you versus somebody else, all right? So that's what I'm trying to get at right here. So it's better to have 100 fans who love and engage your content versus 1,000 fans who don't really like or view your content, right? So start with this mindset first and you will become more successful. All right, so what do you need? Well, obviously you need an Instagram account. We assume that your account is well-branded and converts as well. So meaning that your account has, you know, your brand on it, whether if it's your personal brand or your company brand, you have an idea that Instagram is all about lifestyle, right? People may have found you via Facebook, which Facebook is all about discovery, and then Instagram is all about, oh, okay, I know more about you, but I want to get to know you. So that's what Instagram is all about, all right? So I assume you have a better idea of that and you have a good you know, Instagram profile and you're ready to begin driving traffic. But if you, you haven't really touched base yet, I'm going to talk a, a little bit about this in the next couple videos and that way you're able to start out on the right foot. But the main goal of this video course is, of course, to get your, your traffic strategies that actually work. So with that said, let's go ahead and move on to video number two. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.